Coach, uh, first week of the season in the books. You get a huge win to start the season at Valpo. Roadshow continues on Sunday. You go into Big Ten territory at Illinois, and uh, the women really fought hard. A four-point game late just wasn't enough. Uh, I think overall you have to be pleased with the way your team really began this season. Yeah, yeah, and taking a young team um, on the road for the first two was always hard, but um, I felt like our kids responded. I felt like we were more disciplined than I probably would have imagined us being this early in the season. Um, still trying to figure some things out, but for the most part, uh, pretty pleased for the, for the first two games. Yeah, we talked earlier in the season, a lot of pieces in this puzzle for you, and uh, all of them performing well. Ivy Wolf comes out and has a great week for you. Peyton Scott, I think, really loves the role of not having to be on the ball all the time. And your bigs really, I thought, performed pretty well for you this week. Yeah, yeah. I think, um, obviously, Peyton, we've said it all along. She needs some help, so she has it. Um, Ivy Wolf, obviously, her first game was pretty extraordinary, and um, she'll continue to settle in and, and help in that right. I think our bigs have really vastly improved the most. Um, I think they're just getting started, quite honestly. So between Amani Freeman and, and Jada Duckett, they'll help inside. This week, uh, again, the road show continues. Uh, you're not at home until the 24th. Tell us about this week ahead and uh, what you're looking for from your team. Yeah, honestly, just the bounce back after Illinois. You know, I felt like it took us too long in the first half to adjust to the speed and the size. Um, going into the Big East as Xavier, we'll see what happens. Yeah. You know, so it should be a good test. I think our kids are excited about, you know, just being so close to Xavier. And I'm excited about what happens on Wednesday. All right, Coach, thank you. Thank you.